Hey, it's Gordon with Triangle Lawn Games, and today I'm excited to talk to you a little bit about something fun, wedding venues in downtown Raleigh, North Carolina. Raleigh is a pretty awesome place. I live here. It's pretty fantastic. Uh, it's got great weather. It's got great people. It's got lots to do. It's not too big, but it's big enough that it has everything you'll ever need. So for that, Raleigh is pretty sweet, which is why a lot of people move here. And they're getting married here, too. So when people move places, they get married. So as someone who actually did get married here in Raleigh, I can speak to this. There are tons of great venues. Um, I'm actually going to talk to you a little bit about the place I got married. It's pretty special to us, obviously. And then there's just lots of really great venues. So as Triangle Lawn Games, we go to a lot of these different places with our games, and they're great for wedding receptions and things like that. Um, so I'm going to talk a little bit about that. We do have a blog on our website that we're excited about. It's the best wedding venues in downtown Raleigh, aptly named, obviously. So here, let's let's get going on this. The first place I want to talk about is Union Station. That's Raleigh Union Station. Yes, it's the train station. And yes, lots of people get married there because it's sweet. As you can see in the pictures here, um, it looks really nice. It's in the heart of the warehouse district, which is one of the hottest places in Raleigh, downtown Raleigh. Um, there's not a ton of parking around there, but I think there's a garage associated with this that people can use when you have a wedding. Um, but as you can see, there's some really great pictures here. It's got a great vibe. Um, lots of great opportunities for pictures. Lots of space. Um, it is a really nice place, honestly. So um, as you can see, this is the Dillon downtown. That's right in the heart of downtown Raleigh. So there's a lot of really good spots here. They've got a grand hall. They've got a terrace. Um, obviously a team in place. So if you're checking out Union Station, um, definitely, you know, keep it in mind because it is a good spot. The next place we'll talk about is Jedi. Um, it's kind of a hidden gem, Jedi event space, and it's the courtyard um, there. It's it's right behind a really good restaurant called City, um, and it's like a Lebanese spot. It's really good. There's a couple restaurants in there. Um, actually, Gravy is an Italian spot that's really good there, too, and good food if you're just looking for a place to have dinner. But this place is really cool. It's got Kind of an exposed brick look. It's got a courtyard out in the middle. It's got an inside space that's you know perfect for a reception or whatever. Um, and then as you can see, they've got the inside space. They've got the outdoor space here. Um, it's a real hidden gem. They say it right there on their their website, but it is really cool. So I would definitely check this one out if you're looking for something with a little bit of outdoor space, a little indoor space. Um, again, parking can be a little messy with this one because it is just like in a block and it, <clears throat> there's garages around, so you might have to park in a garage or you could get some street parking, but it is a little harder to get in and out of there. There's a ramp um, if you have folks that, you know, need a, a wheelchair assistance and things like that. And the staff is really nice and the food's really good. So if you're looking for a cool kind of under the radar spot, I would definitely check that out. <clears throat> the next one I'm going to talk about is Market Hall. And Market Hall is over in the city market area of Raleigh. So a little bit different spot in downtown, um, right across from Moore Square. And it's much bigger. It's a good spot for like a really big wedding. You can have hundreds of people in there. Um, it's got an outdoor space um, alongside it. So as you can see, this is um, this is the building. And then this space on the outside, they can cordon off. I've actually seen in the street here, they've they've blocked off the street with like a nice uh, a wall, like one of those fake grass walls. And then there was a bar out there. And we do yard games out there, Connect Four and Cornhole and Jenga and stuff will fit pretty well. Um, and then obviously you can see here that they do the lights up and it's a really nice space. It's big. Um, as you can see, there's a huge dance floor. It's good for corporate events as well, which is the picture here of MetLife. Um, <clears throat> it's really cool. So, and they talk about, you can have 180 seated for a ceremony, 220 for cocktail style reception, 150 for seated reception. Um, and the market view in general can handle even more places, more people. So that's the market hall. It's a real historic building there in downtown at city market. Keep that in mind if that's what you're looking for. The next one we're talking about is the dock. Um, it's a you know so it's an interesting place. It was um, it's at Seaboard Station and it's really nice. It's like the old um, railway dock and as you can see, it's a nice you know wooden floor, kind of exposed beams. It's got some some nice touches. Um, it is a really nice space as well. We've been in there. There's not a ton of uh, information here, but they do have the virtual tour, so you can kind of run around here, which is actually nice. Um, we'll play this real quick, but I would definitely keep this in mind if you're looking for something interesting and new. It's the dock at Seaport Station. Here's a cool video of it. Nice outdoor space. Pretty sweet. I mean, it is really nice. I've been in there once, and uh, I remember it being nice. It's not the biggest place in the world, but it is nice. So, definitely keep that in mind. That's the dock. And then, uh, drum roll, please. 
This is actually the place where I got married. It's called Vidrio, and it's one of the best like Mediterranean spots in Raleigh. It's really good food. Um, so it's like a three-story building, and the bottom floor is um, Vidrio, the restaurant. And it's really good food. If you've never been there, I would definitely check it out. Um, the top floor is a, it's actually a sports bar. It's called Carolina Ale House. It's all owned by the same company. And it's a really it's a good spot for like, you know, wings and beer and watching football and stuff. It's a cool, cool bar. But then the middle is this pretty incredible um, event space. And so you can see the pictures here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go into the gallery, I think, because it's just a really cool place where they've got good food. And then you can see they've got a bunch of tables and chairs. This is actually a bar in there. Um, and then they've got a space for a band. We had a DJ, but this is like the corner. Um, so all these doors open up and that's like you're on the second floor and then it opens up to the city which is downtown Raleigh it's on Glenwood South which is like the party vibe spot in Raleigh and it get, I mean we got married on a Saturday night in April and it was popping I mean it was crazy down there and it was pretty cool we had a great vibe all our friends and family were up there uh, rocking it and then down downstairs like on the ground it was pretty cool um, they had you know this is this is the kind of vibe you can get there there's not a ton of pictures here for whatever reason um, you know but they do have the virtual tour which is pretty nice as well. But I, I can't recommend this place enough. It really was cool, and it had a lot to offer, honestly. Like, you can kind of see, this is the upstairs. This, you go upstairs. Um, we go up to the banquet room. Yeah, so this is like, this was the room where you have your seated reception. You know, you can have food and stuff, and then it goes out to here, which is like the mezzanine, and then people would also sit out here. Um, and it was a seated kind of um, dinner thing which was cool. And then over here, there's a big bar, which was even neater. And then, yeah, so it has bar lounge up here. Yeah, so this was all the bar. It's just super cool. Like, it was a it was a real vibey spot. There is a an actual, they're going to call it the library room, I guess. Um, that's not it. There was the banquet room, obviously. And then the Fiera bar is up. Oh, this is what it is upstairs. This is the upstairs. So this was actually part of our wedding, this little, like, wooden thing. Back here, that door goes to a bridal suite, which is pretty nice. All these doors open up, as you can see, out to the outside. It's a really cool spot. This is Vidrio. This is my favorite spot, obviously, in Raleigh. We got married there. So I would highly recommend it. So if you're looking for more information on that, again, check out our website, trianglelawgames.com. Our latest blog is the best wedding venues in downtown Raleigh. And we hope that helps you on your search. So if you need anything, obviously, keep us in mind for lawn games and and other rentals, we have a HUPA, which is fun. So if you need a HUPA, uh, you're having a Jewish wedding like we did, um, we have that. So keep us in mind. Go to trianglelongames.com and, and happy hunting for that spot. Thanks.